Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to show you how to install an operating system using Windows Virtual PC 2007. To begin, let's click on the start button down here at the bottom. and We're going to open Virtual PC. Choose all programs and find Microsoft Virtual PC in your list. This opens up the Virtual PC console. What we're going to do is create a new workspace for an operating system to exist. Select New. Virtual Machine, just say Next. We're going to create a virtual machine. Let's give it a name. We'll call it My Operating System. And just say Next. For the operating system type, choose the OS that you're going to install. You can use Vista or 2000 or 98. I'm just going to go with Windows XP. Say next. It is recommended that we use 128 megabytes of RAM. We can either go with that uh, recommendation or we can adjust it with this slider. I'm just going to go with the recommended amount and say next. Now it'll ask you if you want to use an existing hard disk or a new hard disk say a new virtual hard disk and say next. It'll ask you how large you want your virtual hard disk to be. 65 gigs is the amount that came up which is 65,000 and some odd megabytes. I don't want to use that much so let's give it 5,000 megabytes would be, which would be around 5 gigabytes and say next. Now just say finish. As you can see, my operating system has been added to the list. In order to install, just say Settings, and for CD DVD drive, make sure that it is set to attach the CD or DVD drive to the secondary IDE controller, and press OK. Now just start, put place your operating system CD into your computer, and say Start. My name is Dave Andrews. I've just showed you how to install an operating system using Microsoft Virtual PC 2007.